Peace Reflections. Welcome back. Um, you gotta do, you, you have to learn how to take responsibility for the things that you do. Stick up for yourself. Stick up for the things that you've done in your past so you can live up to it. So you become a righteous being. So you can become godlike and godly and do the right thing. You should not point the finger at anyone or judge another person because the same message that you judge that person, you're judging yourself. So look at self. Take responsibility for the things that you do. I'm in a predicament that I'm in because of the because of the mindset and me not taking responsibility for me and me not keeping a healthy perspective. You must learn to look at your situation and own up to your situation. Look at self. Self reflect. Get into your natal chart and study your aspects, your genes, your active genes on your gene on your genome, which are are all the aspects in your natal chart. Sun square Pluto. Jupiter square, Jupiter square, Jupiter square, Pluto. All those things make up you. That's your characteristics. That's who you are. That's how your mind works. And if you change those, you can become a better person. You can start to think healthier. You can start to use, utilize people around you, utilize the knowledge. Because if you don't utilize those things, you'll be in your lowest self. You'll vibrate to your low self. Whatever frequency of thoughts that you're thinking about, that's the frequency that you'll be on. So start to take responsibility for yourself. Look into you yourself and look into your natal chart and understand why you do the things that you do. So you can change that. So you cannot can not repeat over and over the same things that you've repeated repetitively. You will become a much, much better person, a much, much better um, influential person to other people if you start to look at self, if you start to take responsibility. Because you, you are no help to humanity if you, you are pointing the finger at other people. Because you are showing them that that's okay to do. You are showing them that with Babylon, this place is okay to do. You are showing that you can walk around and you can point the finger at other people and you can not take responsibility for yourself. But you must take responsibility for yourself because that's the only way you're going to elevate. That's why we're here, to teach knowledge of self, to understand self. Knowledge of self is you. It's you understanding you. You understanding your mind, the mind of God. Understanding, okay, how can I change these traumas how can i prevent these 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 things or these thoughts from coming that's changing your perspective that's changing your perspective on why it happened and why it occurred and why it 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 it, it continues and continues to happen over time that's because the universe wants you to take responsibility it wants you to look at self and as long as you don't look at self and you looking at other people and you are you are looking to other people to judge them and, 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 and not look at self, you will always be in the wrong. So I'm, sent, I'm, I'm giving this message because, you know, there's a lot of things that are being said about me and I must take responsibility for that because yes, I did that. Yes, I wasn't taking control of my mind when, 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 when I was, you know, being helped and guided by my, by my, by my teacher, by, um, by, by G. Yes, I, I, I went against with. I knew in the moment because I was in my demons. I was in my lower self. I was looking at the wrong I was looking at it the wrong way. I wasn't looking at it in a healthy way. I wasn't looking at it as he's helping me. He's guiding me. He's showing me the way. 
And so I'm in a predicament that I'm in because I wasn't listening to my listening. I wasn't grasping. I wasn't able to get over my demons in a moment. I wasn't able to bounce back in a moment. So I have to take responsibility for that because now I'm in a, a space in 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 a in a in a in the dom in domain of my lower self. I'm in my lower self right now. But it's okay because my lower self is showing me and it's 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 as my external reality because nothing is separate of me. Everything is me. So everything I see in my reality it reflects back to me. So as long as I stay organized, as long as I keep my mind positive, healthy in a healthy space and a healthy mindset, I will con I will vibrate back to my back, you know, and my higher self, vibrate back to my soul family, back to my, my, my tribal family. I will. But I have to start taking responsibility for the things that I do. I have to start taking responsibility for my actions and, and, and how I respond to situations and how I express myself and how my I have to control my emotions in a moment. Take responsibility for that. Don't let that energy be placed on someone else. Because you don't want to speak up, because you don't want to communicate, or you're afraid, or you think somebody's going to make fun of you. No, you have to take responsibility for those things. You don't want that to be pushed on someone else and, and make someone else look crazy because of the things that you did and the things that you didn't take responsibility for. So, learn how to control your mind. Take control of my, your mind. Take control of you. No one has control over you but you. I love myself. Peace of God.